but the music sounds differently. The whole experience of it to me is just, it's, you know, I mean, maybe I'm just old school and that's just the way that I think it should be. But I sit there and I look at my kids and they'll have like, they'll be listening to some music on their iPhone or have some like little speaker, you know, that, that they're listening it on and it, you know, and they're like, oh, listen to this dad. It's just so awesome. And I'm listening to it and I'm like going, that doesn't have anything under 80 hertz in it. I mean, there's no bass, you know, no low bass at all in it, you know, and you're listening to it mono, you know, and all these things, you know, I mean, you're not listening to it, you know, stereo straight at you, you know, I mean, you're listening to it mono on a, you know, little Bluetooth speaker that big. It's a completely different experience. You know, I'll take, I take my, you know, my kids' friends and I'll sit there and go take them in front of my stereo and turn it on. And I mean, they're like, oh my God, it's like being at a concert, you know, like sitting in the, you know, on like row 20 between the stacks. I'm like, yeah, it's pretty awesome. You know, it's a completely different way of experiencing music. One that I think this, I mean, you know, the younger generations is sitting there, you know, listening to stuff on their iPhones and then they hear like the little beat, you know, the <clears throat> things. They're like, oh man, this is just so good. And I mean, but they miss all the feeling, you know, feeling it thumping inside your, you know, you know your chest, you know, I mean, the, you know, and plus, you know, it's just no fun unless your neighbors three houses down get to hear it too, you know, I mean, right? Isn't that all part of rock and roll? <laughs>